All right, what is going on my dudes? Today we are here talking about Deadpool Spring Cleaning and all of these doubloons or Dublins, whatever they're called. I'm, I'm not entirely sure what they're called. But you know, I wasn't originally gonna make this video, but a lot of people have been asking me what my opinion is on the store and on the deals in general. So I figured it would take me about 30 seconds to make this video for you guys and let you know how I feel about some of these fantastic deals and some of these absolutely ridiculously bad deals, okay? So so first things first, let's talk about all of these doubloons, okay? Um, so all of the unit offers in the store have been changed um, to have a really fun Deadpool type nickname, all right? They all come with these priceless doubloons that you trade into the store and with the pool's gold crystal, so that's great. And the real prize for me is that one-star Deadpool, okay? Now, I don't spend in this game too often, honestly. Um, so back when I first started playing, I didn't pick up Deadpool. So this was my first chance to ever get him. So I did grab one of these offers. I picked up the Mr. Wilson's briefcase offer because there was also something in the spring cleaning that I wanted to pick up, okay? So... First of all, first things first, if you are a person who regularly buys units, now is the time to pick some up, okay? Because you get a lot of really nice things along with it. Now, if you aren't a spender in this game, if you've never spent any money, don't start now. This isn't anything game changing. This is nothing that's gonna make or break your account and you're not gonna be missing out on anything if you don't pick it up. This is very similar to Cyber Weekend or July 4th where you have extra things in your unit packages. However, it's done in a different way. You buy your currency, your priceless doubloons, you go into the store, into the spring cleaning, and you pick up one of these nine bundles. Now I'm gonna go through these nine bundles and tell you which ones I think are of good value for your doubloons and which ones are absolutely freaking ridiculous. We're gonna start with absolutely freaking ridiculous and that is right here, bundle number nine. That will put you back 200 US dollars for one third of a tier five basic and a generic awakening gem. Five star, five star generic awakening gem and a third of a tier five basic for 200 bucks. That's ridiculous, and that is not worth your doubloons. If you really, 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 really need this Awakening Gem, then go for it. But I don't recommend this one. I can't recommend this one, especially when they're doing one third of a tier five basic when they were charging just $100 for them back during Cyber Weekend. All right, bundle number eight. I also am not too big a fan of this bundle. Uh, a five star Nexus Crystal for the equivalence of 100 US dollars. Doesn't cut it for me. I feel like this should be um, about cut in half, okay? 2,500 six star shards also should be cut in half. That should be 2,500 six star shards and a five star Nexus, Nexus crystal for the equivalent of 50 US dollars. So I can't recommend you go for this Nexus. Nexus crystals are really fun and the issue with them is that you can either get Nick Fury or you can get Karnak, okay? You can get Nick Fury, Aegon, and Ghost or you can get Karnak, Venom Pool, and Falcon, okay? So 100 bucks for a gamble like that, I don't see the value there. I can't recommend that to you. But if you want that, my dude, go for that Nexus. Send me a video, I'd love to see it. They're a lot of fun to pop open. Um, bundle number seven. This is very enticing. This is uh, the equivalent of 50 US dollars here. Now this is a 10% tier five class catalyst fragment crystal, okay? and also about a third of a tier five basic. So this is very, very, very enticing for somebody who's in a position like me. And I'll show you my position really quickly. If we go to my inventory and we check out my catalyst, we go to my tier five catalyst, okay? You will see, oh boy, I am so close. I am 5% away from having a rank three six star ghost. I am very, very close. However, 50 US dollars, for a one out of six gamble, I'm not in the mood to do that today. I'm not in the mood to uh, piss my money down the drain today on a one out of six RNG Fiesta, okay? But however, if you are in the position that I am, this is a very good value for you to go for. Tier five class catalyst remains the rarest resource in the entire game. It's very hard to come by. And if you're this close to a catalyst, well, this is probably one you wanna have your eye on, okay? Um, plus a third of a tier five basic for 50 US dollar equivalent. Well, that's not the worst that we've seen. 
Now, bundle number six, this is personally the one that I went for, okay? Bundle six comes with 2,000 six star shards and seven six star six stone crystals. Now we have only seen six star crystals, the sig crystals, very rarely in this game. We've seen them in the abyss and we've seen them in a couple offers in the past. Now this one is the equivalent of 30 US dollars, okay? So 2,000 six star shards for 30 bucks, that's not too bad. You know, I was a couple shards off um, this morning and I just went ahead and I picked this up and then I popped open a six star and I'm pretty glad I did, all right? Um, plus. The six star six stones, those are pretty nice. So this one you can get up to five times. I forgot to mention the two prior, you can get up to two times and the awakening gem crystal or the awakening gem generic, you can get once, okay? Um, bundle number five also has some decent value, okay? You can get up to 25 generic six stones here. It also comes with pretty much, that would be four tier two alpha if you were to get all five of them, okay? Now, the 22,500 doubloons, that's the equivalent of 10 US dollars. So basically one tier two alpha for 10 bucks, that's not too bad. That's very, very good value for your money there, as well as five generic six stones, okay? So that could be a good one if you're still wrecking up your five stars, if you want to get your Aegon sig up, if you want to get your Omega Res sig up, your Namor sig up, this could be a good one for you okay another one here bundle number four this one's okay this one is okay if you're strictly hunting for the six star shards okay because this would be for the equivalent of ten dollars seven hundred and fifty six star shards and you can get this one up to eight times so you can go ahead and do the math there and uh, figure out what that's going to be for you now bundle number three if you're like me and you're just like really dry and tier for class catalyst at the moment well you can get up to 10 tier 4 class catalysts and 10 tier 2 alpha from this, okay? I really like the tier 4 class catalyst selector and I love the value of one tier 2 alpha for $10. I think that's a very good value there. Uh, I think that's what it should be. You know, tier 2 alpha used to be around 100 bucks then it went down to 50 bucks. And I've been seeing it go down and down and down. And after this sale today, I can't imagine anybody buying a tier 2 alpha over $10 ever again. The resource is just becoming more common and more common. That's why it makes me so surprised to see one third of a tier 5 basic for $200. It boggles my mind. Um, what else do we got here? For the price tag of $5 US dollars, you can get 2,250 tier 5 basic, great, and 1,000 5 star crystal hero shards. You can also get 27,000 tier 4 basic catalyst. Let's just call it the equivalent of one tier 4 basic and 500 six star shards. So I also picked up one of these with the free 15,000 doubloons they gave us as well as one of these. Now with this, for less than the price of 100 US dollars, you can get three fully formed five star crystals or two featured five star crystals. That's pretty good value, especially when they've been selling five star crystals for a hundred bucks a pop, which again, boggles my mind. So here you can get about one and a half tier five basic catalysts and 30,000 five star crystal hero shards for less than 100 US dollars. And then we're gonna go back to this again, 200 US dollars only gets you one third of a tier five basic. Who came up with that math and how does it make any sense at all? Um, <laughs> we also have bundle number two, okay? So you can get, up to 7,500 six star hero shards from this one, as well as about, let's just call it 12 tier four basic. So these two, okay, these two, bundle number one and bundle number two, those are probably the best value for your doubloons, as well as bundle number six and number seven. And bundle number three has an argument as well if you're really dry on the class catalyst, the tier four CC, okay? So guys, those are my thoughts on the spring cleaning store. Bundle one, bundle two, bundle six, bundle seven, the best values. Bundle three has an argument, all right? My favorite thing about this is the one star Deadpool. If you're a spender in this game, if you spend things occasionally, I highly recommend you at least pick up the $5 offer here and you get the one star Deadpool because I've been playing the game for over two years now and I haven't had the opportunity to pick up Deadpool until this moment. So who knows when we're gonna see this again, you know? He's a very rare champion. And the best part about it is you get the units with all of your doubloons, okay? 
So my dudes, those are my thoughts on the spring cleaning event. I think Kabam did a very good job with this. Some of the numbers are really wonky, but the good value is there. I recommend just looking past the bad value, pretending it does not exist, as enticing as that generic gym might be, and just look at what you can get for some amazing value for your doubloons. And I can't stress enough, especially if you're going to be picking up units for Act 6 for Abyss, now is the time to do it. We're probably not going to see extra items and unit offers until July 4th. Another thing, the July 4th offers will probably be better than these. So, if you're going to be choosing between this and July 4th, well, I would personally advise you stick around and wait for July 4th because July 4th and Cyber Weekend are always the two best deals. All right, guys, I'm not going to start doing deal offer reviews and uh, talking about sales and everything. This is pretty much a one-time deal. I'll talk about July 4th or if there's something else like this again, but don't expect this too very often, all right? I just wanted to get this out there because this is a very unique event and I think it was handled very well for the most part. All right, my dudes, I hope this helped you. If it did, do me a favor and leave a like, okay? Comment what you think about the doubloons. Comment what you think about the spring cleaning store. And let me know if you picked up that rare one-star Deadpool like I did. And please subscribe if you want to see some more content coming to you really soon. I'll be seeing you around.